All right, welcome back. So uh, today we are doing some more mini Metro. So they had a little poll, the, the team that does both mini Metro and mini motorways uh, to see what new courses uh, people would want that were in the other game. So uh, they released three new uh, tracks or three new areas, cities, whatever. Um, one of which is Warsaw, another is Lisbon, and Tokyo. So we are going to be starting off with Warsaw because that's the one that we need to unlock. It's also kind of odd that they put them like so far up. I'm not sure why they wouldn't just put them at the end, but eh, whatever. All right, let's go ahead and get started. Okay. Just start off with a basic line between the circle, square, and triangle. I'll go ahead and just move up the speed two for right now. We will extend that line for right now. Kind of have to see how things unfold. So we start off with three tunnels. Immediately goes to a unique one. It's interesting. Okay. So mini motorways and mini metro are two games uh, that I do occasionally um, as new tracks kind of come out. Uh, it just kind of depends though. Um, Uh, when they come out. This particular week, I was planning on doing one of them, uh, just to, you know, it fills the, fills the time, and it's just a nice, relaxing, sort of, in-between larger project type of games, you know? Uh, let's take that, and let's take the extra carriage for now. Hmm. Go ahead and set up our uh, third and final line, or the third line that we have access to at the moment. What I'll do is go back to what we had. So since uh, the last time that I did this game, I was actually in uh, Washington, D.C. for a week uh, on vacation, and one of the things that we did, uh, went with a friend of mine, we took the metro, like, throughout the city. That was a lot of fun. I really enjoyed having access to that uh, while there. It's a incredibly useful thing to to do. Because essentially what we did was we stayed out in like Maryland um, and just took the metro line into the city and it was so much more convenient than driving into DC and trying to find the parking and yeah I I honestly can't imagine, like, having driven into D.C., because that would have been just so unpleasant. I think we only drove, like, 
once that entire time, like out in the outside of you know getting there and leaving. But um, we yeah we uh, we got a new rail. Um, let's see. So that is considered a mountain. Mountain or whatever. Um, yeah, we only drove like one day. Uh, and it was just because it was easier to go to these places that we were going to um, because they were farther out from the city center and at that point there weren't there weren't any uh, metro lines going out that far so um it's always annoying when they do these really weird or really out there uh lines like the stations I do kind of wonder, like, what are these stations supposed to represent? Um, my only sort of thought as to what they could represent is, like, sort of districts or cities, maybe. City, eh, cities, maybe, but... Or, well, not cities, but, like little communities but also why would you make it so that they are like different shapes uh, outside of a gameplay perspective i should state it's your carriage that's fine okay. Something kind of like that instead. still want something kind of like that. We're gonna need... Maybe something like that, just to make sure that things stay connected. Uh, we should definitely give this line the carriage. thinking we may want a second train on this one. It looks like we just got the 300 passengers achievement for Warsaw. Okay. One of the really like fascinating things that, uh, well, fascinating and sad things about Warsaw is the entire city that you see is actually a fabrication. Uh -huh. It, like, it all looks like it was originally from, you know, when it was first, well, not first created, but when it was, like, more of a medieval city, um, or a lot of the old buildings look like they're from that era, but, you know, due to World War II, uh, all those buildings actually got destroyed, um, so now basically they had rebuilt all of those buildings um after world war ii 
Um, do we want an interchange or a carriage? I'm thinking a carriage. Definitely thinking we're going to need a carriage on this guy. extra tunnel we do. Pleasant. Okay. Um, looks like we might need another train on this line. Um, the the trip to Washington that was a lot of fun. I I'd highly recommend if you ever go to DC um, or any really any city that has like a strong metro, you should really take advantage of that. It is so nice not having to drive everywhere in a busy city like that. Pop up. We definitely go ahead and get another. Um, let's do something like that instead. It's not that driving is bad. I mean, it's not great, obviously, but there's times and places to do it, and in a busy city, that's just not really the place or the time to do it, to be honest. Um, okay, we need to kind of reallocate. focus here. Let's do something kind of like that instead. Might need another train on this line. Unfortunately, you just picked up all the triangles. We're gonna need to split this line. Or something. Locomotive, yes, an extra line, please. Please and thank you. Okay, we need to kind of figure out how Just 
just have a completely separate loop over here and two entry points that get the get the random stuff off I think will help a lot. So that being said though, I think we can go ahead and that. Let's move you onto this line now. That's a little funky to do a loop like this, and generally that's not what you like to do, um, both in real planning but also, you know, in the game. But I think it is reasonable to do it here, in this instance. It's always kind of annoying with these random stations that it likes to throw out there. That'll be fine, but yeah, we... Um... Do we want the extra line? It could be helpful to maybe split up this loop over here into two separate lines? Maybe, I don't think. Let's take the extra carriage for right now. Throw the extra carriage onto, onto this guy. and pluses are coming up this way. Um, I think we do need a second train on here. Yeah, because there's a lot, a lot of the special uh, stations that are coming through this square. We use that one. In fact, I will probably just... Uh, actually, these are the only triangles. Maybe I'll do it, like, right there. That seems reasonable. Yeah. If there was another triangle up here, then I probably would leave this one out. Um, let's take the interchange. We'll put an interchange there. That's clearly a very busy station. This is um, surprisingly not as busy as I would have thought.
Yeah, part of the issue with uh, having it set up in this way is that a lot of the stations over on this side tend to get um, it is really annoying that they keep setting up these special ones over here. Oh, nice. Here, let me uh, just hit the second major achievement. Um, the... That's looking like a problem. Yeah, that's a problem. About the... About to happen. Um, this... Can I... Like, I... I know there is a train there. I grab you and the other crisis averted. Yeah, I think we are going to kind of hit the, the breaking point here very soon. Um, just don't have enough locomotives, I think. Let's take the carriage. The extra line would be nice, but... Yeah, it's looking like... It would almost be... Good to do something kind of like that. That way, these have an out of some kind. Um, that's looking like it's gonna pop. I don't think I can get a train over there in time, though. we do really need a second line over here just to kind of stave off the <laughs> sheer amount of stations over here. Um, that's looking like a problem. Yeah, that, that is indeed looking like a major problem. I'm not sure there's anything we're going to be able to do to, to save that. I just... no? Okay. Yeah, that just... just barely not enough. Well... I think that was the worst we ever did. Almost 2,000. Um, honestly, it's actually not too bad, like, all things considered. It'd be nice to s just see, like, Boston looks like one of the best ones based off of that number. <laughs> yeah, honestly, not too bad. Like, I realized that one was supposed to be a bit easier since it's earlier on in the list. So, okay. I would say that's going to be it for this episode. Um, so in the next part, as soon as we get back down there, um, we will be doing Lisbon. So thank you for watching, and I will see you guys next time.